What is paranormal? Paranormal is the unexplained. There is so much in the world that we are yet to understand, but through technology determination, we are getting closer to discovering the unknown. We are a group of amateur adventurers who are joining the chase for answers. We are as. <laughs> Welcome to the first investigation by Acid Paranormal. I am Cody, one of the investigators with the group. We recently ventured to Crawford Road in Yorktown, Virginia to investigate the many claims and urban legends in the area. The footage you are seeing now is all pictures and video we took that are evidence-free, but we will get to the meat of the investigation shortly. We arrived equipped with a camcorder, a handheld night vision camera, a professional digital camera, two digital recorders, and a tablet with a spirit box app. Unfortunately, we caught no evidence with the video cameras or the spirit box. Crawford Road runs through Surrender Field, the battlefield in Yorktown where the British surrendered in the Revolutionary War. It also served as a Civil War battleground and talk of KKK activity. Many urban legends surround the bridge overpass on Crawford, but we found that these to be duplications of stories heard throughout the country. We did get some pictures of some orbs. We do not claim these orbs to be anything but unexplained. We just thought they were pretty cool and wanted to share them with you guys. We did catch a really interesting orb while I was conducting an EVP session under the bridge. Here's the audio and the picture. Are you tired of these kids messing this place up? Oh, guys. Huge. Oh, shit. Right in front of me. As soon as you ask them. You see that? that? Mm-hmm. As soon as you ask them. Earlier in my session, we seem to have caught a disembodied voice that none of us can explain. Why is there so much violence attributed to this place? Why is there so much violence attributed to this place? After a bit, we decided to walk back towards our vehicles two miles away. During that trek, we were recording audio. We split into two groups of three, and all EVPs were caught on the recording used by James, Amanda, and Pam. The first two voices seem to be answering one another, and the third seems to answer James. Are you trapped on this land? Are you trapped on this land? Around the corner from our cars is a memorial of Eric Nesbitt a 21-year-old Air Force Airman who was robbed, taken to Crawford Road, and shot eight times. You can learn more about Airman Nesbitt in the Past Lives Matter section of AcidParanormal.com. We split into couples to do EVP sessions at the memorial. My wife and Amanda and I went first. We caught one EVP in our short time there. Listen closely. There's a message we can send to your family. There's a message we can send to your family. During our time at the memorial, I felt as though someone had put their body against my back, and I felt the draining sadness that caused me to begin crying. It's something I've never felt before, and it is a feeling I will never forget. Pam and James conducted their EVP session after us. They felt cold spots, and their flashlight dimmed inexplicably. None of us can understand their first EVP. See if you can make out what it says. It's beyond you now, and I think you should feel free enough to crossover. It's beyond you now, and I think you should feel free enough to cross over. Their second EVP has astonished us all. I actually set down my headphones after hearing it, and it still gives me chills when I hear it. Its relevance is quite obvious. I've got some other people that want to talk to you. 
got some other people that want to talk to you. Following Pam and James, Andy and Hank went to the memorial. Five EVPs were caught during their time there. The first says a name. We're not sure if the question was being answered or if it was just a random name spoken. Do you miss anybody? Do you miss anybody? Andy was experiencing technical failure with her flash throughout the session. Was something causing her problems? Showing. Yeah, it was. Showing. Yeah, it was. The next EVP seems rather obvious in relation to the investigation. Just a flash with a no show on the picture. Just a flash with a no show on the picture. We are kind of torn on this next clip. We believe it either says flash or lost. Just as Andy snaps a picture. What do you think it's saying? Are you lost? Are you lost? The last EVP caught during our time at Crawford seemed to be a fitting end. No flash. No flash. All in all, we could have asked for a better first investigation. We've learned a few things, and we look forward to continuing with other locations. Be sure to follow us on Facebook and let us know of other haunted locations that we may investigate, including residences. Thank you all for watching, and until we meet again.